All right, ladies and gents, about to leave Eastern Sierra Trout Opener 2021. Let's see if we can get into some. There you go. Yeah. All right. Nice. What? You're all right. I saw your line. Yeah, no scent either. There he goes. Another satisfied customer. Just gonna have to tire him out. Damn that that is a toad for here. I was reeling it in and fucking Look at that thing. It's like a solid two or a three. That's a good one. Yeah. Oh he broke off. He did? Oh. Uh, that's alright. Let's get some more. Uh, it's not a mic tank. Nah. Look at him run. Where you guys staying at? Uh, Mammoth, Motel 6. Yeah. I don't know why we were sucking for the stupid Vegabon. Oh, yeah? Uh, it's a bed. Who cares? <laughs> that's a pretty one. Right? <laughs> I normally would love to, but yeah. Oh, it's cold, man. Uh, we got here obviously in the morning. Mm -hmm. It's like 20 
Oh wow. It's in your name, but they said that shit was ice over. Mm -hmm. Yep. They got this uh it's under the tire. Not big here. Oh it's a big one. Might be a pound. <laughs> <laughs> Man, they fight good. Come here, fish. Way goes. Oh wow. Oh, yeah, that's all we do. Okay. Go, nice little bow. There you go, action. Now what did you have on that? Net crawler? Crawler, yeah. <laughs> no scent. Probably a small piece. Yep. Uh, Mike has it. All right, get back out there, little dude. There you go. Let's get some boat. All right, show you the rig we're using. Got a couple of uh, light, small split shots there, and a number 10 hook, and just a third of a inflated night crawler. No scent. Just throwing it out there in the current, and they're hitting it. Let's see if we can get some boat. Woo! Little bitty fella. Yeah, I got fluffy. Be free. Fluffy lives. Good morning. It's uh opener. It's a very fishiness. We're at Jane Lake. The wind and the weather, we got blown right off the water. So uh if we had Dan doing some stream fishing. The lake seemed to be uh too windy, a little unfishable, it's starting to small already. So we're gonna see what we can do. Make something happen. Nice little fish. Oh, Esteban's on too. Got a double. Triple. Triple. I don't want to fall in the hole. Yeah, just up, uh, up, uh, not that much. <laughs> yeah, don't don't be hasty. All right, well then let me just give it a couple. All right. Left. Here, hang All on, right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, that's not too bad. It's okay. A little loose. Here, want me to do it, AJ? Yeah. You 
It's a little loose. Amen. Oh, yeah. Just relax. Just relax. Getting it in. Up, up. There you go. Come on, big baby. Come on. Up, take it. Take it. Okay, all right. Just remember, keep, keep your rod tip a good angle. Keep tension on it. And no big deal. I'm, I'm filming, uh, Jose. Just out of my reach. Look at that. That's a sick. Oh my god, yes. This is so worth the wait. You know, this water's cold. <laughs> oh my god. Here, let me take this off your yeah. hand. Yeah. Black one, it looks like. Oh my goodness. No, that you might put be, a black and white on it for me, right? Kelly, that's bigger than, yeah. Nice fish. Woo! Oh, wow. Look at that thing. Make sure he's all the way underneath the net, Andrew. Oh. oh! Oh! God damn, that's big. Ready? Yeah, no, no. Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, that's double digit, buddy. Wow! wow. Holy shit! That's a 12. That's 12, guaranteed. Whew! That gave me a heart attack watching it. <laughs> There he's 12. We look girth on him. Yeah. I got a scale. Yeah, I got one Oh, sweet. There you go. All right, there's a freaking. Hell yeah, yeah, bro. <laughs> for him all day. Woo! Damn it. I thought I was going to fall on my face, bro. <laughs> so, yeah. 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 Fighting a monster toad in a swamp. guys there you have it uh, crazy opening day um, weather was terrible uh, the wind unreal uh, I've never seen it like that and I've been going up there since the 80s um, we even talked to a, uh, a guy that worked at the marina there in June and uh, he said he hadn't seen it like that in 42 years uh, so I should tell you something uh, the winds were, were so bad we we tried I mean because I, I can't just look at water and not try it and uh, uh, we would find some spots that we thought were protected from the wind and nope, it, uh, gusts would come up and it blew us right off our anchors. Um, we even thought maybe we could drift fish. Um, the wind was blowing so hard, even on the drift with the anchors down, uh, you would cast against the wind or, or with the wind. And by the time you could even get your, your bait in or your lure in, um, the boat was already past it. It was, it was just unfishable. So... We ended up taking the boat back, and you can see in the video um, how wet we ended up getting, which isn't good uh, up there in the uh, in the cold. <laughs> but uh, we survived it. Uh, we regrouped, got together, decided, hey, let's run up to Lee Vining. Let's fish the creek up there, see what's doing, because I know Lee Vining's in a, a little bit of a valley there, and it's up tucked against the mountains, so maybe we'll get a little bit of break from the wind. Um, the only problem with that was is uh, this opener was so crowded. I have never seen crowds that big. Um, so by the time we got up there, um, uh, spots were either fished out or were already taken. It was elbow to elbow. Um, we tried, we searched, went to all the little spots, old secret spots I thought I knew. Um, but it's been 15 years since I've been up there, up in Levining, and uh, some of those spots are no longer spots. <laughs> so we decided to uh, Head back down to Bishop, let's get some lunch, and we'll fish the lower Owens and see what's going down there. Because, you know, you can get some decent fish out of the Owens, and I love fishing the Owens. So, went down there while we were having lunch, got a text message from uh, Esteban from uh, Golden State Fishing. 
and uh, he said, hey, come back, put on some waders, and we got a spot, it's protected from the wind, and we're getting into the fish, and thank God he sent that text, because it, it saved our day. Uh, we loaded up, hauled ass back up the mountain, met up with him, and uh, yeah, he wasn't kidding. Uh, we got into the fish. Uh, uh, Art and Andrew uh, from Golden State Fishing, they're both pro staffers in Esteban, couldn't have been nicer. I mean, they, they didn't have to do that. So to all you guys, huge thanks from me and the rest of my crew that was up there. Um, amazing, you know, that you guys did that. It really saved our day. Um, and we got in some fish. Um, uh, I didn't, but uh, that's on me. Uh, I had at least eight good bites and I missed all of them on uh, mini jigs. I even had a uh, uh, Peter's Custom 1 16th ounce uh, jigs, very similar to a Sierra Slammer. Uh, Toad uh, hit it and probably bit that worm near in half. <laughs> he just didn't get the hook. So I was just snake bit and uh, it happens, you know. Um, first uh, opener I've ever been to where I didn't catch a fish, but. I tried my ass off and everybody else got fish and I was I was very happy to see it. Um, also got to see uh, uh, Kelly catch that uh, that six pounder, uh, which is awesome. She just started mini jig fishing. I think that's one of the first uh, fish she caught using a mini jig, which was, was awesome. And then uh, Art got that 10-3 and just amazing. So uh, uh, it was, it, it turned out to be an awesome, awesome day. Um, stay tuned for part two. That's coming up. Uh, believe it or not, more toads. Um, the trip continued. The wind continued. Um, that'll be coming out uh, later this week. I just got to go through more footage and edit it because, uh, as you can imagine, when we go up there, we do a lot of filming and a lot of stuff happens. So I got to got to put it all together for you. So until next time, you know, remember to like and subscribe. Leave me questions, comments, uh, any questions about the Sierras. Uh, I'm not an expert. I know some things. Uh, I will tell you everything I know, and if you have uh, something I don't know, I will certainly uh, try and find out and get that information to you. Uh, planning to go up there a lot more this summer. Uh, hopefully the crowds are a little less. <laughs> i show you more lakes and more streams that I've fished, and uh, uh, we'll get on it. But uh, until next time, tight lines. Uh -huh.